in today's video i'll be covering everything you guys need to know about the new nvidia app as you guys might or might not know nvidia released a brand new nvidia app it supposedly helps you to pay an fps so i'm gonna be showing you guys how to install it and the best settings for you guys so let's go all right guys just before i start i really want to show you my opinion my fps as you guys can see i'm running about 24 to 25 ish ping in this specific map and i'm running about 300 to like, about 280 fps and uh i'm gonna come back at the end of this video to this specific map and see if my fps or ping has changed i don't really believe my ping is gonna change that much all right guys so let me show you how to actually download it open your browser i don't give a fuck if you use google or fucking microsoft edge open your browser and search in nvidia app and uh it's gonna be the first thing right here so what i really love about this is hold up i'm not gonna spoil it yet but once you're here guys just click on download better i already have it downloaded so i'm not really gonna go through that process you're gonna have to complete a couple of like steps and shit and make sure you complete that my bad and it looks like this what i was about to say is that what i love about this application is that you don't even have to sign up to have like to being able to access your settings it's like the geforce experience as you guys can see by the design but it just has a way more like features and shit which i'm gonna go through them just right now as you guys can see the first the thing you guys have right here is uh your drivers uh, i really have to update them but i'm not gonna go uh through this process right now because i'm recording obviously go to graphics guys and uh, as you guys can see i already have fortnite selected Alright guys, go over here to graphics and click on global settings and uh, these are the settings I really use, RTX Dynamic v Vibrance, if you guys don't know what this is, this makes your game more vibrant and I would highly advise you guys turn this in, turn this on because if you really want to make uh, your game feel like way more beautiful, this is definitely the option for you guys, just click on uh, this little arrow right here, it's gonna be off because of default but select on right here guys. And uh, this is your, the next thing is uh, CUDA GPUs, uh, this is my GPU, if you guys don't have an NVIDIA G uh, GPU, this uh, application is not gonna work for you, I really forgot to state that earlier in this video, but if you have an NVIDIA uh, GPU, proceed with the tutorial, okay, so these are the best settings right here, low latency mode, I use on, I would highly advise you switch over to on, max frame rate, me personally, I think it's like useless to be honest. A power management mode is gonna be set to optimal power by default. Make sure you select perform maximum performance, share the case size. I don't really use this shit. And uh, vertical sync of uh, virtual, rea virtual reality. Uh, I turn this on uh, off also. Then we got the program settings right here. And what you guys see right here is. Uh, as you guys can see my game is unoptimized so i'm just gonna click on optimize right now and uh i'm just gonna me personally i rely more on the fps than the quality so i'm just gonna like go just like this uh i'm gonna go to the performance site i'm gonna yeah just click on update right now and one thing that a lot of people really don't know is that if you see like a gray bar right here if it's like grayish not like green means that you actually need to do something that is out of this nvidia application which i will show you right now so what you need to do is click on windows and r and uh, uh as you guys can see type in percent local app data percent click on ok and uh find your um a uh, fortnite game saved config windows client game user settings uh just click on show more options properties and if this is like ticked we if uh, read only is ticked make sure you untick it and click on apply then restart this application and you should be able to select performance and once you select you just click on update and uh when you scroll a little bit more down there's a couple of settings that i really need to talk about i really need to talk about them also so rtx dynamic vibrance i obviously use on um me personally i've experienced i've exper i've ex experimented with off and on and uh, i would advise you guys switch over to on CU cuda gpus this is my gpu again dsr factors off image sc uh, scaling off low latency mode global on on because i obviously selected you earlier in this video and uh, these are basically the settings guys um settings right here as you guys can see and i would advise you guys turn off anything you guys don't you 
don't use for example the nvidia overlay if you guys don't use this make sure you take this on off game filters and mode me personally i don't really use game filters uh but i'm just gonna keep it on on right now uh automatically optimize newly added games and apps this is pretty unnecessary in my opinion just click on off and once you guys have done that just click here on uh, fortnite click on play and let's see if there is a difference all right guys so i'm back to the specific map and as you guys can see i'm running about 25 to 26 ping uh, and goes down to 22 sometimes and my fps i really don't see a big difference I actually see that my FPS has decreased, but that is probably because I enabled some uh, settings that didn't actually guys tell you about. Alright guys, so it turns out I've been using DataTex 11, so I switched over to performance, and as you guys can see, my FPS is around the same at the start of this video, but obviously, I got pretty good specs, so I really wasn't expecting anything too crazy, and uh, my ping goes down to 20, sometimes even 18 and um yeah so definitely it is worth a try it's really just free and you got pretty much nothing to lose guys so if you're just bored go ahead and just like download this application all right guys so my ping goes on to 17 when i have rebuilt and it's actually safe to say that it did pretty much like get my ping a little bit better guys and uh, it's been your boy Chapel Man. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And let me know down in the comments if you guys want to see like more types of uh, FPS boost videos. And um, been your boy Chapel. Yeah, my Discord server. And peace out, y'all.